A Black Excellence hey. at its finest. Hey. YouTube creative director. I'm a graduating senior at the illustrious Clark Atlanta University. I am Kayla. I'm a senior <laughs> at Clark Atlanta University, religion major. Yeah, all that. All that, all that, all that. So if y'all hear something in the background, it's the dryer. So just try to like sorry. ignore it. Sorry guys, sorry, sorry, sorry. But we gotta let the video go on. So as you guys know, it's Black History Month and this week we're doing like a Black History theme type of thing on the Her Campus CAU channel. So we're just kind of here to talk about our business. So as you guys can see by the title and the thumbnail, the title of this video is Black History Month, My Black Business. So we together and our other best friend Mari, we own a business called So Good Looking Boutique. Um, basically what So Good Looking is, we have lip glosses, lashes, merch and we also have added some of our old items to this website that we do have now and we will those things will be on sale so when you're ready to shop which should be right now <laughs> the link, you know hit that link so i'll below. comment i'll comment the link below but um yeah, I also forgot to say, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, all that good stuff. But um, yeah, we're kind of just going to talk about our business. So basically, we started our business sophomore year of college, yeah. I think so. In our yeah. dorm. In our dorm room. So we were kind of just sitting there chilling, and we like, we want to start a business. So um, before that, actually prior to that, a few months before that, me and another uh, girl, we wanted to start a cosmetic line, which never really happened. But then a few months later down the line, we were all sitting at the dinner table, and we were like, we all want to start a business. But we all wanted to sell like slick different stuff. So we wanted to sell hair, just a bunch of stuff, like a big old online boutique. And we was like, why not put all that together and make one big boutique? You know, like, so that's basically how the business came to. Um, we recently got our business license in um, a couple months ago. I don't even know what month, probably December or November. I don't know. Before break, before like November, November, break, November, September, something like that. So we recently before Thanksgiving break. Yeah, we recently got our business license. Y'all probably like, girl, what? So like our sophomore year was like 2017, 2018 yeah. maybe, and we got our business license in 2019. Mind you, we launched, unlaunched, relaunched. We did a bunch of relaunches before getting our actual business yes, license. Again. Yeah, and we just relaunched for good this time. We're really back. So yeah, um, so that's basically how our business came to. Um, I'm trying to think like what other questions you guys may have. Um, I just, I don't know. I just want to say like if you're a black person <laughs> and you want to be an entrepreneur because I feel like there's not a lot of black entrepreneurs. Like I feel like we see a lot of black entrepreneurs, but we don't see a lot of successful black entrepreneurs. Um, and I feel like go for it. You know what I'm saying? Um, our own, we don't only have that business like for me I like to have multiple streams of income so I'm a youtuber that's a stream of income and I take that as being an entrepreneur or business and then I just recently dropped merchandise for my YouTube content and my YouTube channel yeah so like we're just trying to be like you know a jack of all trades all of that stuff there's people we know that do nails lashes all of that stuff so if you want to be an entrepreneur I say go for it we need a lot more black businesses out there in the world I shop with a lot of black businesses more so um, and if you're not an entrepreneur and you don't want to be an entrepreneur I say support black businesses because who oh, we need it we need to keep the black dollar within the black community okay and I feel like um, 
it's always an issue when it comes to black businesses because y'all, a lot of people tend to be like, oh, y'all charge too much, this, that, and the third. But I personally feel like if y'all knew what went into making a business on the money we spend, everything that we lose before we gain, then y'all would understand the and value the dollar amount that we charge. Because shopping and wholesale to start these businesses is not cheap. And we have to see a profit. So we have to set our prices accordingly, you know? And just like y'all can go buy Foot Locker, Chic, Forever 21, Charlotte Ruse, Rue 21, Victoria's Secret, Pink, all of those other businesses, Louis Vuitton, Gucci, Prada, all of those expensive businesses, they all started from somewhere. And just like we're trying to start, like, you know, you, we need that support. And we need people to just believe in us. Like, everybody just wants somebody to believe in us. We believe in us. But it's even better when, when you're a community. Support. Yeah. And it's like... Even outside of the community. Just everybody's supporting yeah. each other, you know? A little bit goes a long way. So, yeah. even if you buy a lip gloss or you buy a tweezer or you buy some $5 sunglasses, just, just something. something. Or not even... even or promotion. You know, yeah, even if you don't want to pay nothing or you don't want to buy something, you could donate a dollar. Donate two, three dollars. Or just... Yeah. Post Post on your store, things like that. And this is not just for our business in general, your friends business, people businesses you see in general. Like I feel like, like the Chinese people, like no offense, no shade to nobody because I don't discriminate, but you know, they all have beauty supplies, all of this stuff. But, and they, they keep the Chinese customers. dollar. Yeah, they, they top customers are us. And they keep the Chinese dollar in the Chinese community. The white dollar stays in the white community. Why can't we keep the black dollar in the black community? Instead, the black dollar goes to all these other communities. Like, I don't get it, you know? And I personally feel like a lot of black businesses are very affordable compared to all this other stuff y'all buy. Louis Vuitton, all of that is expensive. And I don't know, I, I know for us, we put a lot of work and hard work and money and all of that stuff into our business. And I'm sure all these other black entrepreneurs do as well. So I don't, you know, just- The same do rags y'all go by at the beauty supply store. People hand make those and they're better for your scalp. We hand make our lip glosses. Like it's a lot of right. stuff. And then it's not even that, into it. no shade because I love Fashion Nova. I'm rocking it right now. But their wholesale shipper and all of that is on AliExpress. If you want to start a business and sell Fashion Nova jeans, all of that, go to AliExpress and buy it in wholesale or go on um, Global Global Sources. It's an app called Global Sources, I think. Go on there. Their vendors are Alibaba. on there. Alibaba. Their vendors are on there. Like all of these places y'all shop at, Gucci, all of that. They get. They all have the same vendors. You just have to actually search. And it's not cheap to buy wholesale. Don't get me wrong. We be spending bank, okay, to get these lashes, all of that stuff. Right now, I'm wearing our lashes, you're wearing our lashes, I'm wearing our lip gloss, you're wearing our lip gloss. Like, we wear our stuff. We, you know what I'm saying? You have to be your biggest supporter. And that's just period. But yeah, we just wanted to give a little bit of motivation to black businesses, black entrepreneurs, and people that want to be entrepreneurs. This is a short video. I don't know if we talked about a lot of stuff that y'all want to know about, but if you have questions, let us know. Also, I do want to be a shameless plug real quick on, um, February 29th, right? Yes. On February 29th, we are co-hosting along with another person named Aaliyah that's in Collegiate 100 of Atlanta. We're, co we're all co-hosting and putting on a Black Business Expo. So I say if you have a business, you know somebody with a business, anything like that, definitely sign up. I will also link that link in the description box, the um, form to register for the Black Business Expo. Register, it's only $25 to have a table and be a vendor. It's going to be extremely, extremely big. So if you're in Atlanta, if you're in Atlanta, sign up, sign up, sign up, sign up. It's a great networking event. Even if people don't buy your stuff, you could get your name out there. You can network with other entrepreneurs, maybe collab on some stuff. I'm going to be there as our business and as my YouTube personality. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, like come on now. Let's work. Let's network. I could promote y'all stuff. Shop. Little stuff, you know, come, come shop. shop. If you're not an entrepreneur, come shop, come check out all the great black businesses. It is for black businesses. It's a Black History Month type of thing. It's gonna start being annually, so definitely come out shop. Support. Shout out to us for putting this on. It's the first in the city, okay? A Black hey. Excellence at its finest. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, but yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I kinda just wanted to make this video 
not just about our black business, but just to give you guys some motivation. Like we're 21 and we started our business at like 19. Like y'all yeah. got it, y'all got it, y'all got it. Into the real, real, real world. Real world. Yeah. And you know, I've been managing myself on YouTube by myself since 2016 when I was 17, 18. So I'm just saying, you know, it's a lot. It's a lot of success around you. It's a lot. It's a lot. Reach out to people. Reach out to me. Reach out to her. Reach out to anybody. Just get it done. Okay. We're super period. nice. Period, but yeah, so happy Black History Month. That's our Black History Month video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, all that good stuff. Bye! Bye. <laughs>